Hey guys, this is going to be a tutorial video on how to tether your laptop or PC, including a Mac, to your iPhone. And this means that you can use your iPhone's 3G connection or Edge connection, which might be very slow, but you could try to use that. And use that as a modem. So you're using your iPhone's connection as a modem, which means that you can use your laptop and get on the internet without being on a Wi-Fi network and this is especially good if you're on a trip and you have a uh, 3G connection so you can still use your iPhone even if you're not near a Wi-Fi connection it might be a little slower than your Wi-Fi but you're still getting connection you can look at web pages on um, videos you can try to load I think they they kinda work depending on your 3G connection and where you are depending on how many bars you have they will partly work I mean it might take longer to load than usual it all depends on your connection so what you have to do first is you download this application called PDA net wait I zoomed in way too far sorry PDA net from Cydia your iPhone has to be jailbroken for this application to work it's called PDA net you just go to all packages go down to P and it's called PDA net once you do that, uh, you're going to go to your computer. Our, this is my first video, guys, using a Mac. And uh, I got the new MacBook, or as you see here. Wait, can you see that? No, you can't. But it says MacBook. I got the new MacBook, 13.3 inch, 2 gigs of RAM, 2.4 gigahertz. And uh, this is my first video using it in a tutorial. So what you're going to do, right now I'm at home and I'm on my West 1608 network. But what you're gonna do is you want to create a new create a network, and then what you want to do is you want to name it whatever you want. You want to say uh, let's just name it some random thing. Okay, so I named it like blah blah blah. <laughs> you can name it whatever you want, guys. So click OK. Don't require a password or uh, keep it automatic. Also, so then once you do that. You're going to go to settings on your iPhone. It's taking a little while to load. Then you're going to go to, and there you see, that's my new network that I created from my computer. Then, once you connect to that network, it's not going to work yet, guys. I'll, I'll verify this right now. Let's see, I'm going to click iPhone on the App Store. Well, it actually did work. That's weird. Oh, okay, guys. This is, it's actually funny that this worked because last time it didn't work because uh, I had not gone to uh, PDA Net, the application, and verified. It takes a little while for it to verify your connection. That's why in the beginning it did not work. And there it's computer connected and it's telling me how many bytes are going through each second or whatever the connections that it has and what's going on so I just wanna uh, I hope this tutorial works and uh, make sure that you go back to PDA net after you have checked it off in settings checked off the network that you're, you have created and that could be a common problem why it didn't work so you're just gonna click on PDA net Go back and make sure that it's verified your network. And it's going to say computer connected. And again, you do not have to have Wi-Fi for this. The main thing is you're creating a modem from your iPhone, iPhone's network. And guys, um, you can leave some comments in the comment box below on uh, if this works with the 3G connection. Uh, obviously, it's going to work with the guys I think I said 3G it's actually edge connection so you can comment if it works with an edge connection it probably does but it's gonna be extremely slow and sorry guys I was kinda shaking around in the video oh, I don't know it's kinda hard to use one hand and do this I had to do a lot of things at once so guys uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, thanks for watching make sure to check out my website iphoneexpert.com the link will be in the description and check out some of my other videos and follow me on Twitter. The link is also in the description. Thanks guys. Uh, message me if you have any questions. I can definitely help. 
with this it's pretty simple just make sure you follow the, tu the tutorial all the way and uh, thanks for watching